Hey everyone, Siddharthus here, back with the next episode in my Daisy server hosting series. This episode is going to be all about expansion. As always, links for any downloads are in the description. If you haven't seen my previous video on setting up a server with Omega Manager, I'd highly recommend that you go check it out. The card is in the corner now. So let's get into it. So expansion comes in two key parts, the mods themselves and the mission files. Here, we have the current layout from the expansion team on what mods you need for different setups. For me, I'd like to do the whole thing. So that includes all this stuff. For now, I'm not including the AI portion of the mod in this video or on my server. The other side of this chart outlines other options you can add to your server if you don't want everything. The second part of expansion are the mission files. There are different sets of mission files for different maps. This also includes files for traders, if you intend to use them. So the first thing to do is install the mods on your server. With your server shut down, click on Overview, and then go to the Mod Configuration tab. We already have CF and DABS framework installed. Expansion also includes builder items, so you don't need to download this either. So we need expansion licensed. And expansion bundle. Once we've added both of those, save the changes and go to the dashboard and click Install Untracked Mods. Expansion does require a wipe, so if you're adding this to a server that's been started before, you're going to need to delete the storage folder. Go into your mission file, C drive, Omega Manager, servers, whatever you've named your instance ID, MP missions, then the map folder you're using, and then delete the storage folder. Then go back to Omega Manager and start the server. It's good to start the server at least once so all the files get populated. Once it's running, we can shut it down again and add the mission files. To get the mission file template, we need to go to the expansion GitHub and download this file. For me, I'll be using Trinaris. First, we need to copy the expansion CE folder into your mission folder. I'll be using Trinaris Plus. Once that's copied over, go back to the mission file template we downloaded and open the CFG economy core file. Copy these lines, including the notes, and then open up the same file in your server's mission folder. Technically, you can paste these lines of code anywhere in the file as long as it's between the open and closed lines, but I prefer to put them at the bottom. I also keep the notes and add more detail, so I know if I want to remove this mod later, I know which lines to remove. So go back to the template folder. Now we need to do the same process for the CFG event spawns file. Copy the lines and the notes. And paste them at the bottom of your server's event spawns file. Finally, to add the traders, go back to the template file.
and open the expansion folder. Copy the objects and traders folder, and then paste them into the mission file folder for your server. Then you can start up your server. And if we hop into the server now, we can see the expansion loading screen. Once we're in, we can teleport over to one of the traders. And we can see the default trader setups that come with expansion. In the future, I'll have an updated video on custom traders and the Daisy editor. Hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, the expansion discord is linked below. There are a ton of people there that can help you out. Bye for now.